Hey everyone, what's going on? Sinlo here, and today I'm going to be showing you guys the new Call of Duty Black Ops 2 multiplayer trailer breakdown. Uh, now, this is my first breakdown, so stick with me here. Uh, but I did find a lot of interesting stuff, so uh, this should be interesting, so let's start her up. So it starts out with some windmills and a guy running, a guy running up a plane. And uh, once we stop here, you see that there's a little class set up right there. Now that's obviously the gun that he's using right there, and then a pistol as a secondary. Uh, so this is the new customizable perk uh, class setup system. It's a really cool, and I can't wait to actually sort of uh, customize it myself once I get the game. But there's really nothing much else to tell from this. Uh, other than all the random, you know, icons right there. Three of those must be his perks, and uh, two of those must be his equipment. I don't really know much else about this. Uh, but anyways, let's continue on. So he starts running again, and then he throws this cool little stun grenade, which sticks into the ground. Look at right there. Uh, it's it's got a little knife which sticks itself into the ground, so it stays there. It's not like a normal stun or flashbang. It doesn't roll around. It stays there. It, you could probably stick people with this. It might even kill them like a tomahawk. I'm not really sure about that. Uh, but once we look at this, it shoots off a little electric pulse, probably blinding them. Uh, I don't know if it's like an EMP grenade where it t uh, turns off their equipment. But anyways, right here you can see that once he got a kill, the little thing popped up saying revenge. So this is going to be the new way they tell if you got a revenge, an execution, a payback, or a double kill, anything like that. So uh, that's kind of cool. So then it changes scene right here to this guy with the red dot sight. And right there, you could see a guy across the map through his red dot sight. So this is the new attachment that we've heard so much about uh, where it's like x-ray vision. And, and if we continue playing the scene right there as he's about to kill that guy who's uh, peeking behind the crate you could see the other half of his body through the crate so this is definitely the new attachment where you could see people uh, through stuff it's the x-ray thing it's you it's the camper buster uh, so that's a really cool attachment I'm not sure if I like it so much uh, because you could kill people really easily you know where people are but I do think it's definitely cool there's gonna be a lot less campers because of this attachment so moving on here, he kills the guy, starts running, and then dolphin dives. He freaking dolphin dives. I'm going to replay this for you guys. He slow motion dolphin dives through the air, so that is definitely back. I love dolphin diving in this game. A uh, really awesome thing that Treyarch adds, so let's get on with it. So then he kills someone, and this guy is through a wall, so this is obviously the x-ray attachment, just more evidence proving it. Fully kills the guy, then he gets up, he reloads, a really cool weapon right there. Then he starts running, and right here, you could see that he switches to a different attachment uh, scope thing. So this is just like that one ACOG attachment from MW3, I forgot what it's called, uh, no one really ever used it, it sucked, but this is obviously back if any of you guys actually use that. So then he kills the guy, and then look at that little funky equipment he drops down. It's, it's like some type of heat radiation thing. I'm not really sure what it does, uh, but it definitely does look really cool. I can't wait to use whatever the heck that is. And uh, then here's just the quad rotor, the cool quad rotor plane. Uh, we see some uh, heads up display, some point of view from the quad rotor vision. Uh, just blowing up a car, going ape shit. The enemy tries to shoot down the quad rotor, the quad rotor goes kablooey, and then where are we now? Oh, we're at the, the ride shield. So uh, right there, that definitely looks like a ride shield, which is, which is really cool. Uh, ride shields used by Treyarch is unseen, unheard of. Uh, so this is really cool. Using ride shields in Black Ops 2 will be definitely fun. And uh, what's cool, right here, it looks like you could use a gun from the ride shield, which I'm not really sure if I'm cool with uh, using a gun from a ride shield because I don't want to die from people using that. It seems kind of noobish, uh, but I don't really know how they're going to be using that yet so uh, it's definitely going to be a cool thing to see how that ends up in multiplayer but anyways right there it looks like a plane dropping a care package which is this kill streak this is how this kid got his kill streak from a care package uh, so that's pretty cool i don't know what that kill streak is called yet but right there before this next scene it shows this next person's class which is titled blade and uh, obviously it has no actual weapon just a pistol so uh, this kid customized his class to be a knifing only class which is a what a lot of people were interested in making so he runs up to this kid, starts shooting him, kills him, and then once it shows the third point of view, right there, it looks like there's a blade in his hand, like a ballistic knife. Uh, so then he knifes the kid, throws a tomahawk, so obviously tomahawks are back. He gets a pretty gnarly headshot, now it's going to show someone with a sniper who runs up to someone and quick scopes him, showing that quick scoping is back. Now it's going to show like a bolt action, semi-automatic, some type of gun, uh, but he gets a freaking quad collateral, which is just insane. Uh, I guess they just wanted to add that in there to be funny or something, but that was, that's pretty sweet. Then it shows people dying, some other random stuff, reload animations, now it's going to show some funky equipment, I have no clue what the heck that is. Uh, but now as you can see, once he starts shooting, it's showing like a laser dot, so he has some laser dot attachment on his weapon uh, so he knows exactly where the center of his sights are so that's kind of cool I don't ever remember a laser dot in multiplayer before but that's really interesting I can't wait to be using that in multiplayer 
Then he kills the guy, then throws C4 in that window, so C4 is definitely bad, guys. And uh, now a bunch of cool little bird planes are running around, flying in the sky, and it uh, looks like they're kamikazes. So my last guess, a few commentaries ago, that there would be kamikazes in Black Ops 2, I uh, was definitely right. I, I showed you guys uh, these little flying bird planes are like kamikazes, just uh, flying themselves into the enemies. I don't know if you can control them to fly them into the enemies, but it's really cool. Uh, definitely armed with explosives, so I cannot wait to use those. I Those are so cool looking. Then the guy blows up and then the video ends saying the future is black, black app. So that's it for this video. I do hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, this video did take me a few hours to make, like one or two hours. Uh, so a like really does help a lot uh, considering how much work I put into this video. And I do definitely guys make sure you subscribe if you're not already subscribed. I really would appreciate it and every single comment does count as well. I do reply to most comments anyways. Uh, so that's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Comment, subscribe, like. All that fun stuff and bye.